How do you add an EBT card on Amazon? So there's a shortcut affiliate link in the description that will take you to this page, which is the page that you need to go to to add your EBT card. Once you're here, you're going to go to this big yellow button that says add your EBT card. From there, all you have to do is enter in your card number and the name on the card. After this step, if you need to follow through with anything else, you'll just fill that out and it will be on your account to where you can use that card to make purchases on eligible SNAP EBT items. So if we go back, you can see that you can shop fresh produce and pantry stable groceries with SNAP EBT. You get 50% off of grocery delivery. And so that subscription is normally $9.99. It's $4.99 per month if you have an EBT card added. And then you also get 50% off a Prime membership with an active EBT card. So you can also sign up for Prime after your 30-day free trial and get 50% uh, off after that. And then finally, if you're in an eligible state, you can shop uh, with your cash EBT if, you, um, if that applies to you. So you can learn more right here. And you can see all the eligible states down here. And basically, if you uh, receive temporary assistance for needy families, cash assistance on your EBT, EBT card, um, you can use those benefits to pay for eligible items on Amazon, including non-food items, etc. cetera. Uh, basically, at, when you add items to your cart, you choose cash EBT uh, at checkout. And right now, it's not currently accepted on fresh or whole foods market goods. And, but that's it. I mean, there's a link in the description that will take you to this page uh, that you can just add your EBT card. And that's how to add an electronic benefits transfer card on Amazon.